Thursday. Hey everybody, another smoky day here. Thursday, August 9th, 2018. I am a Canadian walking to work, drinking some coffee. My name is Jay. Yep. And this is a great day. Every day is a great day for different reasons, but today is a great day. Thursday on a week means that you've passed the midway point and that it's all downhill. So on a short week like this, some people got a short week, some people didn't. Either way, you're way more than halfway done now. Just by the fact that, the sheer fact that you're getting up on a Thursday, heading out to work, doing your part, doing a good job, and then heading home, means that Friday and then the weekend. So I hope you guys are, are already starting to think about, you know, what should I do on the weekends? But a little trick that I've learned to make your weekend feel longer than it is, is to always plan something on Friday that you would normally do on the weekend. So do something Friday night that you would normally do on the weekend. Then your body thinks it's already Saturday or Sunday and it's really only Friday night. That's why they say, you know, Thursday is the new Friday because, you know, if you start your weekend on Friday at five o'clock when you're done work, then boom, you've got a whole e extra evening of weekend going on. A little mental trick I use, try and do something on Fridays and then relax for Saturday, Sunday. So tell me what your weekend plans are in the comments below. And uh, definitely we can start a conversation about, you know, the best way to start your weekend early. All right. So my walks to work are a little bit more routine now, now that I'm back at the work and not on vacation, but should be a good time. Mm. Some good Thursday coffee. Had to run across while the road was sparse. <laughs> so getting back into the routine after having a lot of vacation is a tough thing to do because your mind just wants to do vacation things like daydreaming. Think about all the fun stuff you did on vacation. And it wants to just go to the beach. But, you know until we can work remotely from the beach. Guess I'm going to my office. Which begs the question, where do you do most of your work? On the beach? In an office? You know, maybe you have a job where you need to be at a certain spot. Like if you work at the hospital, you kinda can't work from home. You have to be at the hospital in order to help the sick people at the hospital. Or you can just bring sick people home to your house, which you may not have the equipment to actually take care of them there. Mm. Well, interesting questions about how to start your weekend early, where you work, you know, good comments stuff. Today, on this week where we are doing all sorts of celebration, I want you guys to think about what you're celebrating, what you're doing, and relaxing, moving towards the weekend, and really just kind of hone in on seeing the routines that you do have, and maybe just tweaking them a little bit, you know? Maybe be more grateful, more joyful, more appreciative, and more positive. I appreciate you all, and we hope to talk to you again tomorrow. So, tune in. And hey, if you want to be reminded about all the videos, like and subscribe and hit the notification bell and all that jazz that you've heard a million times. But for serious, I'm here every day. You might as well be too. We can walk to work together. All right, see you guys on the flip. Logo time, logo time. Oh yeah, logo time. So here's a question. If you could work from anywhere in the world, where would you work from? You know, a lot of people say, oh, I'd love to work from a tropical island in the middle of nowhere, which would be great. But 
It'd be like, hmm, could I? Could I technically do my job from there? If they had internet, they, I sure was that good. Don't think my boss would go for that. I think he would just get too jealous and then he'd be like, no, you can't do that because I can't do that. <laughs> but, yeah, think about your options. Where in the world would you be if you could be anywhere and doing your job? So much smoke in the valley.